Hello everyone. So I was looking at this uh, question on the community about uh, excluding non-working days and weekends when calculating uh, some kind of a time difference day difference. So this is something that people do quite a lot in Jira because in Jira we have uh, different dates like creation date uh, or date of the transition or resolution date or uh, date a specific thing happened or it could be a custom field and for this particular uh, question James is trying to calculate difference between two dates based on two custom fields and uh, the way he has done it here is using a smart value which is great and uh, this is how you should do it but he's asking about two things number one in this particular uh, calculation can you also exclude the weekends and uh, and basically the non-working hours so basically only the business hours and business days the second question is that what about the time zones for example if uh, you have in your Jira instance users from different time zones they will of course work on Jira and they will have their own dates will Jira take care of uh, the, the those dates uh, based on uh, the time zones so let me answer both of them uh, let me try to answer so for calculating the business days when you're trying to calculate the difference time difference you can use this uh, business days function uh, I, i'm not really sure yeah it is a function so if you go to this particular documentation smart values you can do a control f and search for something like a business uh, days and you will get some ideas about uh, things that you can do with the uh, basically the unit so if you talk about uh, let, let us say you're doing a difference and if you try business days I believe this will give you business days again I don't really remember if I tested this uh, uh, usually I test things very quickly but I don't really have time to go and play with it right now but uh, I hope it will work uh, this is what this particular document uh, says I'm trying to basically look at this documentation it is doing exactly what James is doing but the unit will tell you whether you are retrieving uh, hours or business days so I believe uh, as per this particular example the business days will and it should give you business days I uh, basically wanted to uh, and of course you know you have some documentation here so business days are considered to be Monday to Friday 9 to 6 p.m. I believe it will pick up from Jira so again test it James in your instance and also about the time zone so usually time zones are uh, I mean that the, the look time zones or basically the dates are based on uh, the person who is basically doing something and if I create a ticket or an issue and I'm in uh, UK the time will be that particular time uh, based on of course my locale but if I if I'm in Delhi then that will be of course different so I believe it is the epoch time that is stored uh, in the database uh, but I think time zone is a time zone is uh, taken care of for you but again in your specific use case uh, James go and test it uh, using business days again it is business days but I believe if you're able to get business days then I'm, then I'm sure you can convert it to hours if you need to but I think uh, getting the business days is uh, is more important and and that is it that is all i wanted to talk about in this video i hope you enjoyed watching this video and you learned something new today thank you thank you very much bye bye